Hi beautiful. Today, I'm gonna lose my mind. I did last week and it's time to do it again this week because I just wanna ruin my weeks. Like that's my goal. I'm doing something that seems difficult and I know it's going to be because I have experience with stuff like this. I'm about to follow Mackenzie Marie's highlighter hair color tutorial. I'm obviously gonna use Miss Manny Quinn today and give her sickening, hopefully, highlighter hair color, which I don't think it's gonna be sickening, but we'll see what happens. Last time I followed one of Mackenzie's videos was when I did Sharpie hair color and that one sucked. And I pretty much poisoned myself with um, Sharpies. If you guys don't see me next week, it's because I died from inhaling too many toxic chemicals. By the way, don't try this at home. I may be risking my life today and my assistant's life because I'm not doing this by myself. Let's just do this and hopefully it turns out good because that would make my week instead of ruining it. And that would be sickening if we could start the week on like a positive note for once. <laughs> so let's do it. Let's color some hair with highlighters. So I obviously have to learn first how to do this. So why don't we just skip through Mackenzie's video and just quickly learn together how this all works. I just kind of like machete chop it, so I'm just gonna oh. do that and- Okay. We're gonna need a machete. You go get it. I'm serious. Well, Emma's gonna get a machete um, so that I can actually do this video. And now she's dipping it in water. Shake it around a little bit until it turns white. Right, I've done this before. Side and blow the ink into a separate glass. I'm gonna get so lightheaded. And that's how you extract the ink from the tube. Kind of disgusting, I know. For the sake of science, it is worth it. Why do I do these things to myself? I don't wanna do it. I don't wanna do this today. I mixed up the colors a little bit. Whoa. Really pretty color right here. That is bright. The color is not dark enough. It's not gonna leave any pigment in your hair. So the darker the dye, the more brighter your hair is gonna come out. Okay, she said the darker the dye, the more pigment your hair is gonna come out. Yes, I'm aware of that. I'm just gonna start blowing these things into the glass. Like, I'm gonna be here all day, probably blowing I think this is enough dye. I have a hair dyeing bowl. I'm just gonna pour all of this in. We're pouring it into a mixing bowl. A lot of ink. Take some conditioner and I'm gonna fill this. That is so much ink. I just mix it up. There's literally green in my mouth. <sighs> This just looks harder and harder every second I'm watching it. Kind of nasty, but it's okay. She got it to work. Now I'm going to make the yellow. So it's basically just the same process. Look at how bright. <laughs> Dude, there's so much marker. Okay, so now she's applying it and it looks so beautiful. So bright. <gasps> oh my God. Oh my Dude. <laughs> I want this to work for me. I want it to work so bad. I'm gonna leave this in my hair as long as I possibly can just because it is highlighter and I want it to soak in all my hair. And I'm gonna go wash it out and I'll let you guys see it, the finished result when I'm done. So she said she left it on as long as possible. I don't know what the hell that means. I don't know how long I'm supposed to leave it on for. Directions are unclear. Oh, hi there. Didn't see you over my- f Oh my God. Highlighter hair? You guys, I literally dyed my hair with highlighters. It's definitely really, really bright. It's not highlighter bright, which I was expecting a little more from that, but it looks dope and I'm ready to try it out. So let's grab Miss Manny Quinn and let's get some highlighters going and let's get highlighting. That was so dumb. Yeah. I have knife. I have Sharpies. I have waters and I have empty cups and I am scared because this knife looks really sharp. I don't think I want orange. Let's do pink. Pink never fails me. <laughs> Oh, I did that too. I think this just kind of gets like the color out of like the bottom half so that you can actually like blow on it. I don't really know how long I'm supposed to wait or what I'm doing, but <laughs> we doing it. <laughs> Yo, it's working. Okay. Okay, go me. Now all I have to do is, I guess, mix this with conditioner, but I'm gonna do like a lot more of these. But guess what? I'm not doing this on camera because I need Emma to help me. I'm sure it'll take me at least 30 minutes to do, and I'm sure I'll come back with a lot of frustration to share with you. Hope you look forward to that. I'll be right back. Okay, boom. That f suck. It's, Emma's like literally about to cry. I'm sorry I made you do this. Plus we might have to go to the hospital for like food poisoning or alcohol. I don't know what kind of poison you call this. Just regular poisoning I guess. I highly recommend not doing this. That took so long. I think like an hour of our time to blow out literally a million of these. I bought so many highlighters for this. It's expensive to do this by the way. Some of them like really mixed up well. Like the pink looks beautiful but then the green just won't not be chunky. Like it just wants to be chunky. I don't know what that's about. But I 
want to lighten the green a little bit because I think it's just like really ugly. It's like forest green, which is like not ugly, I guess, but like, I don't know, it could be a lot more fun. So I'm going to mix the green and the yellow. Okay. Yeah, sure. Totally. It's not mixing well. I mean, that looks bright. Woo. Okay. And then we'll just use the yellow by itself. And then of course the pink, cause the pink looks dope and I'm excited about that one. So here are my three colors. This really ugly green that won't mix together, this yellow and this beautiful pink. I'm gonna do pink e-girl bangs, green on the top and yellow on the bottom of the back. If that didn't make sense, well, I don't give a f cause I'm just gonna do this cause I don't wanna do this all day, which I'm gonna end up doing all day. I already know it guys, because I've never done one of these things and not spent my entire existence finishing it. Hey girl, what's up? What are you looking to do to your colors today? You wanna try out a new color line? Oh my God. I mean, I would totally let you try my own X Mondo color, but today I actually have another newer line of color. It's called Highlighters. You're gonna love it. It's my first time doing it, so hopefully it's all good. All right, let's do this. You're gonna love the colors. See how bright it is? It's a very conditioning formula, actually, yes. We flew this in from France for you to try. You're my first guest. We're gonna try out this brand new color together. Let me just tell you guys, this. This is gross. I mean, it looks really bright. However, I'm getting all over me because this color is so chunky. I do feel like this is gonna work. I'm feeling super optimistic today. This is the best these projects have gone in the beginning. So I'm hopeful, but hesitant on being too excited about it. But that is yellow. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's working and I'm getting excited and I should stop getting excited because my dreams are gonna be crushed when I wash it out and it just doesn't do anything. Let's just get this front section on, shall we? This resembles what to you, Ms. Manny Quinn? This resembles highlighters? That's so funny. That's so weird and random. No, I didn't use highlighters. You're so funny. Like, ugh, of course this isn't highlighters. Why is it chunky? <sighs> Girl, don't ask people why they're chunky. So far, so gross. And so far, I am seeing a lot of color payoff. I just don't feel like it's gonna last. Also, what the f Mackenzie? Like, you literally didn't tell me how long you let it stay for. So how is a brother gonna know? It's like cottage cheese. I'm sorry, Miss Maniquin. Forgive me for covering your face in cottage cheese yellowness. <sighs> my entire floor is covered. My entire arm is covered. Love my job. However, could do without the mess. I could do without that part. Boom. I mean, that looks better than Mackenzie's. I'm not gonna lie. I'm just curious if this is gonna actually come out the way it looks right now. Highly doubtful. Let's go on with my chunkier cottage cheese concoction of a color. Should I do half of her head blue, green, what? And then half pink? I don't think I have enough color. I'm not mixing more. I'm sorry guys, I'm not doing it today. Don't make me. Why am I like this? I was supposed to do the front pink, but my mind went yellow, so I did yellow. Why am I like this? Now what am I gonna do? I can't do an ombre with green and pink. It's gonna look ugly. I'm gonna do half her head pink and half her head green. That's what's gonna happen today. Just painting the head with some highlighters. Yes, I am. Oh, yes, I am. Oh, yes, I am. This is also really bright. I don't know, dude. I'm just gonna get it on there. So far, the experience has been a little bit better than the Sharpie one, I have to say. If you had to choose between the two, as of right now, I'd probably say this is better. Like, a little bit easier to use. Not by a lot. And now we're just gonna comb it all through because I ran out of color. It's actually looking really good. And the best part of all is that I haven't quite lost my mind yet. So it's actually been quite easy besides the mixing part. It actually looks really good. I went to the hospital. She's back now. Did you tell them all the blowing that I had to do? Yeah. It was so intense. My jaw is still recovering. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, you guys, all the chunkiness kind of went away. I don't know how, but I'm not gonna question it. And just like that, guys, we've made it to the pink side. Just gonna do the same thing. Just gonna apply this on there. And this one, guys, is the most beautiful mixture. Wait, this is really gorgeous. What? What the hell? Why is this so pretty? I'm mad, but also really happy. Is today gonna be the day that this works out, like one of these projects? You guys, this color is going on so beautifully. It almost feels like it's real hair color. I just don't understand what was the difference. Like Emma and I did the exact same thing for all the colors. And for some reason, the pink was just like the only one that cooperated perfectly. I don't know what that was. And it actually smells quite nice. I love toxins.
Whoa, dude, that was the fastest application of color I think I've done in a while. And it looks stunning. These are definitely neon. I mean, I wonder if it's gonna come up brighter than Mackenzie's. It looks like a little bit brighter than hers, I think. Dude, this is fun. I'm excited. I guess I'm just gonna let this process for like an hour. This looks sick. That was actually not that painful. And I'm optimistic for the results. I'm, I'm excited to see what happens. I guess I'm just gonna rinse this off and blow dry it and style it and I'll show you guys the finished result. Hey guys, um, didn't quite go as planned. Um, just like last time it actually came out like this is it. I mean, she looks gorgeous. Like, don't get me wrong. Like, whoa, hello, gorge. But as you can see, the only thing that took was the pink. The pink looks amazing. It's beautiful. It's vibrant. It's shiny. She looks amazing. Where's the yellow? Where's the green? It does look in real life like it tinted the hair just a tiny bit. But other than that, the only thing that showed up was the pink. I would say I'm surprised. However, I'm not because this is exactly, well, no, the Sharpies work better for sure. But every time I try to use something that's not color to do color, it doesn't work correctly. And that's no surprise because you should just use color. It's a lot less work and it's actually a lot less expensive, believe it or not, um, than buying uh, how many packs? Like six packs of Sharpies and wasting like $80 worth of conditioner. And also almost breaking my jaw. And <laughs> breaking like, your jaw, a hospital visit. A hospital visit. It, it was, was a lot. Like, you yeah. Know, toxin poisoning from all the highlighter. I mean, was it worth it? No. No. I'm so sorry, Gwendolyn. <laughs> it's not looking good. Thank you for trying out the new color today though, the highlighter color method, I didn't work well. You can come back tomorrow for a redo, okay? All right, I'll see you later. It was bad. Moral of the story is don't use highlighters to color your hair, just use regular uh, neon color, I guess. Even like really cheap color, that's not that great. We'll do a better job than that. You know, it could have been user error. I don't know how Mackenzie's hair came out that vibrant. I really don't get it. I'm like skeptical about that. I don't understand. Em and I were like talking behind the scenes, being like, what did we do wrong? We literally did everything step by step and tried to do it perfectly. It just didn't come out right. Well, you guys, there you have it. Highlighter, hair color. Don't do it ever. Make sure you guys follow me everywhere else. Here are all my social media handles. Go for it. Wow, I'm everywhere. Make sure you guys text me. Yes, this is really a number of mine. Yes, I really do be texting back. And yes, I really will be texting a few of you if you text me right now. Make sure you guys check out my color line if you want color that looks a lot better than this today at xmondocolor.com. You can also check out my hair care brand, xmondohair at xmondohair.com. And also find us on Instagram at xmondocolor and xmondohair. If you guys aren't already subscribed, well, there's a, literally a button right below me that says subscribe. You can totally press that. That'd be dope. Press the like button and the bell icon if you want to be notified whenever I post a new video. Thank you very much. Today's Instagram shout out goes to Ashley. She says, hey Brad, I was wondering if I could pull off blue hair. Ashley, 100,000% you could pull off blue hair. It would make your blue eyes look so blue. I don't know. I think it just enhance your look, make you look so fun and cool. And I would love to see it if you end up giving it a try. That's all for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. And don't forget to live your extra life. And I'll see you next time. Bye guys.